And the thing mm -hmm. that's always impressed me about what you guys do with the path pilot control is it's the same whether I'm running the plasma, the router, the mill, or even the lathe. And I, to me, yeah. that's yeah. really the piece that unlocks it all. Yeah, I mean, you know, when it comes down to uh, controlling anything that interprets a machine code of some kind, whether it's G-code on a milling machine or a lathe or whether it's Python on our robot, you've got... Um, Kind of the same set of tasks and so we've got i mean user interface roughly broken up into a set of persistent controls that stays the same down at the bottom we've got position and status readouts in the middle and we've got kind of manual and jogging controls here over on the right and then uh, we call it a notebook with different tabs along the middle and then of course the toolpath display and this is this is basically the same regardless of um lathe mill router uh, clearly on the lathes, we kind of lock you into a 2D representation as opposed to this orthographic view. But otherwise, um, we try to keep things as similar as possible so somebody that has experience with one of our machines can easily transfer that experience to the other machines.